Uh, this is Aina again from the, the Golf Posture Pod, and I'm here with Paul Kenny, PGA Pro, uh, Director of Instruction at Rock Rimmon Country Club. I'm going to do, uh, use the Golf Posture Pod and do some medicine ball drills. Uh, a lot of trainers, physical therapists, will do medicine ball drills with their students to try and get them to work on rotation, stability. So here we're going to do the same drill, but you're in the Golf Posture Pod. We're going to make sure that you stay in your angle when you do like a backswing rotation. So Paul's in his angle here right now. He's going to rotate to the top of his backswing. You want to make sure that he stays nice and stable, that there's no tendency to stand up. And we can check that on the numbers, okay? So come back to address again. So he's around nine. If he goes to the top of his backswing, that number should stay pretty stable or maybe increase just slightly as his pelvis starts to rotate back in his backswing. So it's a very good way to get feel and feedback to keep your golfers in a good posture, good spine angle when you're doing medicine ball drills. And I'll do a little forward work. So from here, he's going to have a little mini backswing and just go to early uh, or post impact. But this time, he's trying to increase the numbers a little bit. So as the pelvis starts to rotate in the forward swing, the numbers should go up as the pad gets pushed back a little bit. So we'll do a couple of drills here. So we know that he's staying in his angles. Most of the time, we'll do medicine ball drills, but we start to kind of stand up to try and leverage the medicine ball. So here he's getting feel and feedback. So he's staying in his angles, working on good core stability, lower body stability, and more importantly, staying in his angles. Uh, for more information, go to golfposturepod.com.